In this section we will make approach for rapid diagnosis. Let us start with the cardiovascular system. It includes three parts, heart, peripheral arteries and peripheral vn. Heart, about anatomy and physiology at first you should know about these points. The heart comprises two muscular pumps working in series, covered in a serous sac called pericardium, that allows free movement with each heartbeat and respiration. It is important to remember heart anatomy structure as follows. The right heart, right atrium and ventricle pumps deoxygenated blood retuming from the systemic veins into the pulmonary circulation at relatively low pressures. The left heart, left atrium and ventricle receives blood from the lungs and pumps it round the body to the tissues at higher pressures. Atrioventricular valves, tricuspid on the right side, mitral on the left, separate the atria from the ventricles. The pulmonary valve on the right side of the heart and the aortic valve on the left separate the ventricles from the pulmonary and systemic arterial systems, respectively. Cardiac contraction is coordinated by specialized groups of cells. The cells in the sinoatrial node normally act as the cardiac pacemaker. Subsequent spread of impulses through the heart ensures that atrial contraction is complete before ventricular contraction, systole, begins. At the end of systole the ventricles relax and the atrioventricular valves open allowing them to refill with blood from the atria, diastole. Normal resting pressures on the heart and great vessels is about these ranges.